Jai Guruji, Shukrana Guruji. I'm a little nervous today because um, I was not expecting to do this. Um, and also because the reason I'm here, I, I'm at Guruji Mandir, my papa isn't here to watch me do my satsang. But I hope someone somewhere is going to record this and I can get this to him. Um, first of all, thank you for all our family who are here to celebrate my niece's 40th birthday. I always thought that I was going to do a satsang on my daughter's birthday. That's something I always wanted and asked Guruji for. And here I am celebrating my other daughter, Meher's uh, 40th day. So I'm very, very thankful and uh, grateful for that. Um, I'm going to talk to you about how I came to Guruji Mandir. Um, and go, I'll go in and out of Hindi and English. So excuse me. Um, I started coming here after I saw my dad coming here. We've spent our entire life coming into Mandir and churches and Gurdwaras. We go in, we do darshan, we leave. It's always been chalo chalo, chalo ho gaya? chalo chalo. And Guruji Mandir was the one place that you had to be like, Papa, chale, thoi dera ruke? Panda minute? Aadha ghanta? And I was like, what's going on with him? Who is this person? This person who is now never wanting to leave Guruji Mandir, never wanting to be away from this family that he calls uh, my Guru Parivar. And um, I was very curious. So curiosity brought me here. I started coming to the Mandir with him and I was like, I want to see what this is about. I mean, I have a lot of faith. Um, I've always been a Sai Baba Ji Bhakt. I've uh, read Sai Satishtra and I know the power of Guru. But no other connection other than that. So I was at Guruji Mandir coming with him, just coming and seeing him getting into his meditation, like trance-like place. The only place that calms my father down is this Mandir or any Guruji Mandir. And that was very shocking for me to see. Um, so I'll share now a couple of satsangs that are close to my heart. Uh, we have been building our, our house, uh, renovating it from scratch for two years. So as, as all the hurdles come, we also had our share of hurdles. Um, inspections that were not being passed and were failing at every point. Um, and you know, this was like maybe our fourth inspection, nothing much had changed. But we had requested another one, hoping against all odds, that we pass. So my husband had gone to the house uh, while I was at home. And I don't know what got into me. I closed the door. I had Guruji ka mantar job. Chalaya, uh, and I started Googling Guruji, Guruji ka significance, why Guruji is Shivji. And I started reading while the mantar job is going on. Now, in my head, I'm thinking, oh, Guruji is Shivji. Shivji is Guruji. That means Shivratri must be a big day. Tab tak mujhe ye bhi nahi pata tha. Mujhe ye bhi nahi pata tha Shivratri kab hoti hai. Not that I'm not religious. We celebrate Shivratri. But in my head, I didn't know ke kaun se mahine mein Shivratri hoti hai, kab hoti hai. So I'm just like, you know, this year I think we should go to Guruji Mandir on Shivratri. Feels like a very big day. So I said, I thought, socha, mantar jab khatam hua. The minute mantar jab khatam hua, Jai Guruji unho ne bola. My husband called from the house. We passed. And I said, we what? I'm in absolute denial. I was like, kya ho gaya? He's like, but Bani, something very surreal happened. The inspector came and said, tumne ye nahi kiya? Tumne wo nahi kiya? This is passing violation. This is not, this is failing violation. But pata hai, aaj mera mood nahi tha that I fail you. Today mein soch ke aaya tha ki tumhe pass karunga. He's like, that's what he told me. And this is known to be the most arrogant inspector, the one we were convinced has like no part of you know, he's just not a very nice person to talk to. He's like, today I felt like passing you. He's like, I don't know what happened. And I'm just like, Jai Guruji, that was crazy, scary for me. Uh, in my first moment that I felt like, maybe there is something that Papa attracted out there. So I told my mom and my mom that I was passed. And I was listening to Guruji's mantra. So they were obviously, they're like, just we have to thank Guruji. We have to thank Guruji, we will go to Sunday. I said, OK. Even still, I'm a little bit skeptical, right? And I'm like, yeah, Mama, I also said that I have to go to Shivratri. So this year, we will go to Shivratri, Guruji Mandir. She said, very good. Because it's usually them who are saying, like, go to Mandir, go, kids. Please, come. You know, it will be good. And we blindly follow. Not that we have anything against coming here. But that pull was in there. 
तो उस दिन संडे को हम आए शुक्राना करने के लिए एंड आई वी वो ऑल वेरी ग्रेटफुल दैट यू नो इंस्पेक्शन पास हो गई अनदर बिग होडल वी कैन गो फॉरवर्ड और एंट्रेंस पे जैन अंकल मुझे मिले एंड आउट ऑफ नो वे आई मे बी ओनली सर जय गुरु जी टू हिम ट्वाइस बाई नाउ एंड जैन अंकल मुझे कहते हैं बेटा शिवरात्रि की सेवा पूजा करोगे एंड आई वट शिवरात्रि वो कब है सो आई क्विकली टर्न अराउंड शिवरात्रि कब है तो लाइक इट्स कमिंग and would you like to come to shivratri puja i said absolutely yes and that is how i met purvi aunty anushka madhu aunty who actually made me finally feel like that family that mom and dad keep talking about the guru parivar right they folded me in they made me feel like i am also a part of this family um and you know i found new ways to show my gratitude so um that was one of my tiny satsangs and so as i got you know lots of other things happened from like a driving through a very scary snowstorm to uh going through a lot of pain i realized that the minute everyone you know in our family is now very used to saying jai sai ram jai guruji jai sai ram jai guruji the minute those words come out somehow the problem dissipates and it's just become like even as non believers like when i talk when i used to talk to my husband when my dad used to talk to me there was like a non belief right like oh yeah that's nice except sure there was a little bit of that i'm not going to lie but as as i allowed myself to have that faith and get carried away by that faith now i see the power of those words that jai guru ji shukrana guru ji something good happens and i immediately say shukrana guru ji something scary happens and my the first words that come out are like jai guru ji jai guru ji and i've started seeing how that changes my perspective how it changes the mood how it gives me the courage to face whatever i need to face so as i was getting closer and closer to guru ji ek aur thought aaya mere dimag mein ki bani you go always say your sai baba ji bhakt when was the last time you went to sai mandir you keep going to guru ji mandir ye kya hai right even my kids are like we don't go to sai mandir anymore and i felt a little bit of guilt i was like oh what am i doing so um that day i was very restless i opened my sai sachitra which i you know i've read several times and often times when i get very restless and very anxious i open my sai sachitra read a few pages and it calms me down so i randomly opened and the first two three pages i read were about this bhakt this sai bhakt um who was also similarly torn between sai baba and a guru that he believed in and at the end of it he came and shared with sai baba that uh main aapko chhod ke udhar kaise jao you know how can i go to my other guru while i'm with you um and sai baba had said it's not that you're going somewhere i'm coming with you wherever you see me i will see you and from that day onwards i started seeing guruji and sai baba as one so no matter where i am where i'm in sai mandir or where i'm at home whether i'm at this mandir i get that same feeling of connection i no longer ride that guilt that oh i'm supposed to be doing this or i'm supposed to be doing that i feel a belonging i feel like uh, you know this is where i am meant to be um and so i'm really happy about that um and i just wanted to say thank you for having me and thank you for letting me share my satsang jai guru ji shukrana guru ji om namah shivaya shiv ji sada sahay om namah shivaya guru ji sada sahay 